<laughs> Mate. What's up guys and girls? Welcome back to another edition of The Cocktail Guy. Now we are only days away from Christmas, so I thought I would continue to create my festive cocktail creations, this time using the oh so beautiful mincemeat, the filling of the glorious mince pie. Now for those of you who haven't already seen it, please do check out this cocktail here. This is my Mold Martinez, another seasonal festive riff on a classic cocktail. Before we continue though, guys, you know the rules. What am I gonna ask you to do? I am gonna ask you to subscribe. I would love to see this channel grow. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you like the content. Don't forget to drop me any comments should you have any questions below the video. Now the cocktail I'm gonna be making today is a riff on a Manhattan. Now I have already pre-infused my bourbon. I have some here. Now I've taken 250 mils of bourbon and I have infused it with three tablespoons of mincemeat. Left this to infuse for about 25 minutes, half an hour, giving it a bit of a stir to encourage the infusion. And I have filtered it through a coffee filter. And what we have here, as you can probably see, is a beautifully rich, it will be super flavorful, mince pie infused bourbon. Now I'm gonna put this filter to one side. So to make this cocktail, we are going to be taking 50 mils of our bourbon that's been pre-infused. Let's put it hot. Some sweet vermouth. Today I've gone with the glorious cocky. Twenty mils. Now I've chosen to add some caramel here. So this is a salted caramel that I've made myself. All this is is some sugar which I've put on the pan, put on a hob allow it to burn, to caramelize. To that I then added some water and then adding it back to the heat, I've stirred in additional sugar and some salt. And what this does is by simply adding one to two mil of a cocktail, you get this super lush, textural, sweet, salty, caramelly, bitter ingredient, which kind of it lifts the cocktail, it's absolutely divine. And that's it, three ingredients. Literally, just the infusion, stirred down, sweet vermouth, caramel. We're gonna add some ice and then stir it and then serve it up in a martini glass. Some ice. Now, as I've said before, guys, please do respect all the ingredients that we're mixing here. Give it the respect they deserve. Make sure you chill to dilute and also to mellow all of these flavors. There we go. Uh, I'm gonna serve this cocktail up, so I've got myself a nice little martini glass. Here we go. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Now I am not gonna garnish this with a zest. I don't think the zest will add anything more to the aroma. It is so powerful in flavor. The sultanas, the raisins, the dried and candied peel that goes into the mince pie infusion. It is uber delicious. I say is because of course I have tried this cocktail before. And there we have it. Let's give it a go. <laughs> Mate. Now I have said before that the mold martinez that I made in a previous video was going to be my cocktail of choice for Christmas, but I'm not sure. It's mince pie Manhattan hasn't pipped it to the post. Uh, let me know what you guys think. I hope you enjoy making it, if you do. If not, do try out the Mold Martinez. This is an uber lush cocktail. Uh, before I go guys, don't forget as I said at the beginning of the video, please do subscribe to this channel. I would love to see it grow. 
Give me a thumbs up if you enjoy the content and don't forget to drop me any comments below the video should you have any questions. Um, but until then, and hopefully see you in the next video. Cheers, guys.